All right, Fight Fiend Mix here for HustleBoss.com with Angel Heredia. Angel, first and foremost, who do you think you want? Who do you think won, man? Oh, my guy, definitely. Right. He did a fight, you know. He did great tonight. You know, but once again, the judge is always... Uh, this time the, the referee as well. They didn't count, uh, they didn't count the drop of the 12, so that hurt us too, yeah. you know. So we had the judge, it's not even the judge. Yeah. I mean, uh, the referee, I'm sorry. Referee, no, yeah. Um, so do you think it was uh, the tough weight cut that may have affected uh, Porter? No, I think, no? Uh, well, I mean, frankly, I'll tell you what, my guy was running, you know, my guy was very powerful to him. He was really hurting him. That's what Porter decided to try to box out. He didn't want to go forward 1 1. He wanted to steal the rounds the last 10 seconds. But my guy didn't let him. So I think mostly it could have been a possibility that wake up. I don't know. I, I really don't know what they do after the wake up, frankly. But my guy, I know what my guy was. He was very strong. He was very powerful tonight. Drop him on the 12. The referee decided to put the blind glasses on. And that's a shame. Yeah. You should be ashamed of yourself, referee. You should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> Yeah, really. So, like, there was a few times where uh, your Denny's was kind of showboating a little bit. Do you think that might have affected him or the scorecards, you think? No, I mean, my no. guy was like, come on, let's go fight. He wanted to really go and exchange because he knew he had advantage. You know, he has the power. He had the... I mean, he got everything set for the night. Porter didn't want to do that because at the beginning he tried to, then he couldn't really penetrate. And then he was getting hurt a lot. My guy was really, really hurting him. So, obviously... He wanted to fight, and Porter didn't want to. He thought he thought he wanted to be cute, walking around, you know, jogging around the, the ring and smiling. Yeah. He thought he was going to be a cute guy. And at the end of the day, he probably knew he was going to get the, the decision anyways. Yeah. But you know, I respect it is what it is. We do we did our job. My guy did his job. He won this fight. Everybody saw that. A lot of people when I said it was a close fight, but my guy won the fight, and I I'm really proud of him. I'm very good. And happy with Salas and Capetillo did a great job as well. All the team itself, you know. So yeah. we, we, you know, we did. I'm, I'm sure some things coming up. Yeah. New fights ahead. So yeah. And on that note, I was going to ask you that this kind of puts your Denny's in a weird situation because um, people saw how dangerous he was and can probably still avoid him because he doesn't exactly. have a belt it anymore. Be, it could be the way. It could be that he gets more fights or people are people. I think uh, in this business, it's it's it's, it's, it's it's you know it can go like that because some athletes you know some boxers want to you know want to cherry pick. I, I'm not saying they're afraid of the guys; they're just being smart. And maybe that could be the reason. But like at the end of the day, that division is hot. There's good boxers in that division, yeah. so something come up. Something might come up. Maybe rematch. Mauricio Suleiman mentioned in the in the previous fight that there's a there's a rematch call on the contract. Uh, Ugas is asking right now Mauricio Suleiman to give him a rematch to hopefully Mauricio can be a man in his word and get him a rematch. Mauricio, he needs to get a rematch. <laughs> Eso sería lo más importante, Mauricio, para la credibilidad del boxeo. Vamos a darle la revancha a Ugas. Se te aprecia, gracias. Mauricio. So that is the next step then, try to get the rematch, not that's, try to go after another belt or wants. anything. Yeah. That's what he wants, and if it doesn't happen, then obviously... There's more fighters out there. Uh, all right. There was a few times where uh, Jordanis had Porter cornered, and he seemed to like kind of let him off. He, he got out of. He didn't cut it off. Wasn't cutting off the ring. Um, I mean, what, what was the plan behind that? Was he okay with well, leaving you, him? Did out you of the notice? Ring? Did you notice Porter every time he would get rumbled with my guy? His legs were a little yeah, wobbling. Yeah. So he felt that. So that's why. That's one of the things that he didn't want to. When you got no legs or your legs are kind of weak, because you have to understand the beginning, my guy was hitting him on the stomach first uh, three or four rounds, that takes your legs away, especially if you hit him hard, right? So perhaps maybe the legs were not responding to cut the, or the style of my guy was very good to not allow him to cut them. So sure. like I said, the strategy was also important in this fight, and Douglas did a good job, Salas did a good job, but you know, we got that result what we got, but I think Ugas um, loses this fight by a terrible decision. But frankly, he won by the people, so yeah. he's going to win more opportunities. Yeah. Right? All right. Um, should he get the rematch, which hopefully, you know, this is what we're trying to aim for, uh, what do you think he has to do differently to get the victory? Because, you know, Porter's a tough I, guy. I, 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 listen, if we get the rematch, Porter's <laughs> frankly. Yeah. He, my guy's going to be even stronger. <laughs> so, Porter, come on. You're a good guy. I know you. You're Christian. You're a good guy. You're a man of God. Give us a rematch. Come on. Yes, you know, let's call it fair. You know, it wasn't a fair call, Porter. Let's do it. 
Yeah. Let's All see right. if he does. Let's see if he does. I'll see him right now. We'll, I'll see if he wants to do it. We'll look forward to that. Thank you so much, Daniel. I appreciate, appreciate your time that. one more time, Thanks. man. Thank you again. Thank you. Five Feet Mix with Hustle Boss.